Hi friends, I'm Storm Team 10 meteorologist Jeff Hanowich. So what's ahead for us? Well, we've got one more comfortable day before the summer heat and humidity comes back into play. When that happens, rain chances will also increase for us here as we head into Friday, Saturday, Sunday and Monday. Clean sweep on the radar for us right now. Clouds may increase a little bit tonight. Otherwise, we're pretty quiet out there for tomorrow. Looking at highs in the lower 80s. We're warm, we're dry, we're pleasant. Any clouds in the morning should scour out late in the morning into the afternoon. So increasing sun for us tomorrow. And then look at this high on Friday, 87. We're warmer, we're more humid, and we will have the chance for some pop-up thunder showers developing. Best chance will likely come for us as we head into the afternoon and early evening hours. So again, clouds sticking a little bit for us tonight. Even if that happens, we're still going to be dry. Thursday looks to be a day where we start out with some clouds around. Notice that those clouds go away by around lunchtime. Then as we head into tomorrow night, we are fair. Friday starts dry with sunshine. It ends up with a little more cloud cover along with the chance for a few thunder showers. Best chance for these few thunder showers will lie along into the west of the parkway. Friday afternoon into early Friday evening. It's 54 right now in Hot Springs. 64 Roanoke. It's 66 in Lynchburg. Upper 50s to near 60 out across the New River Valley. Dew points right now, mainly in the 40s and 50s. It's a little muggier and it has been this way over the last 24 hours or so into Danville and also into South Boston where your dew points are in the low to mid 60s. Everybody else though, really dealing with dew points mainly in the 50s. We are looking at below normal dew points here for the last three days. Keep in mind the uh, June average for dew points in the low to mid 60s in Roanoke, Lynchburg, Danville and Blacksburg over the last three days or so. Those dew points have been between around 53 and 59 degrees, so it has been uh, feeling pretty good out there for us here over the last couple of days. Keep in mind that in May 2018, the average dew point in Roanoke was 62 degrees. That makes May of 2018 the muggiest May ever on record, and we probably figured that just because of how much tropical moisture and tropical air we had throughout the month of May. Now, the dew points are going to still be pretty nice for us on Thursday, but Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, those dew points are back into the mid to upper 60s, so it's going to feel stickier. The air that you wear comes back into play for us here over the course of the next 48 hours. Right now, the wind's anywhere between 3 and 10 miles per hour. A little bit breezy out there earlier today. Winds have settled down tonight, and I don't think that the winds will play a huge role in our forecast for tomorrow either. So your forecast for tonight, pretty comfortable, even though clouds are going to thicken a wee bit. Overnight lows tonight in the upper 50s. For tomorrow, we're looking at highs in the lower 80s. A pretty pleasant day out there for us. All right, your extended forecast showing skies turning mostly sunny tomorrow. I got a few mountain showers or thunder showers Friday near 90 on Saturday. Oh boy, breezy at times with hit or miss thunder showers. Sunday and Monday look to be days where we'll have a better chance for scattered showers and thunderstorms. Temperatures fall into the 70s briefly Monday. Pop up thunder showers Tuesday and Wednesday of next week with temperatures returning into the mid to upper 80s by next Wednesday. Today we forecast a high of 81. Actual high was 81. Yes. $100 in the pot, <clears throat> $330 so far raised for the Mountain View Humane Society. I'm crossing my fingers and hoping for the trifecta tomorrow.